Center. Latest world news. A powerful 7.8 magnitude earthquake in Ecuador has killed at least 77 people and injured more than 500, Vice President Jorge Glass says. The quake, Ecuador's largest since 1979, hit at 1858 on Saturday, 2358 GMT, near the northern town of Muzn. Widespread severe damage is reported with a bridge destroyed as far south as Guayaquil about 300 kilometers, 190 miles, away. President Rafael Correa, who is flying back from a trip to Italy, has decreed a state of emergency. He said, this is a very painful test. I ask the country to be calm and united. Let's be strong, we will overcome this. He added, roads and hospitals can be rebuilt, you cannot recover lost lives. That's what hurts the most. Mr. Glass said that at least 77 people had died and 588 had been injured, adding that the figures could rise as a number of affected areas had not yet been reached. He called for calm, particularly in the city of Portovo, amid reports of a lack of public order. Gabriel Alcivar, mayor of the town of Bednil, which is close to the epicenter, said, We're trying to do the most we can but there's almost nothing we can do. He said dozens of buildings had been flattened and looting had broken out. This wasn't just a house that collapsed, it was an entire town, Mr. Alcivar said. Carla Peralto, a resident of Boyaca, one of the worst affected areas, told I never felt something like that in my life. It was so strong. I was feeling very, very scared. I was thinking God, please stop that because maybe I die today. Serious damage was also reported in the city of Manta with an airport tower among the buildings destroyed.